many San Diegans are still struggling with unemployment, and as our way of life changes, businesses close, a sense of uncertainty remains. But there is hope and there is help. President and CEO of San Diego Workforce Partnership, Peter Kallstrom, joins us now. Peter, thanks so much for your time this morning. We sure appreciate it. Good to be with you, Eric. What advice do you have for San Diegans that are, need some help, maybe starting, finding a new career? Some people out there trying to reinvent themselves right now. Yeah, it sure is a unique time, and, and the recovery is still uncertain, as, as we're seeing every day. The, we can do several things right now at the Workforce Partnership. On our, our homepage at workforce.org, we have an array of uh, services, so we have switched to completely online support. So we've got an on-demand video training library up and running right now, which provides people with a lot of different avenues to explore for different career options that are out there to get trained in Microsoft credentials, for example, or Salesforce, or to explore the array of other careers that are out there. We're, we're in this very uncertain time, but now is the time to really look at where you want to be in your career as we come out of this. So it's a great website, obviously, but a couple of online workshops today that are going to be focusing on finding hidden jobs, online job search strategies. I mean, tell us about these these workshops happening today and, and what people can expect when they tune in. Yeah, they're free for everyone. And those workshops, uh, to be able to look for what is out there right now, because with such high unemployment, it is very difficult to find work. But work is out there. There's a number of essential services, jobs, some sectors are coming back slowly so it's in a way to find uh, a way into different employers who are hiring who may not be uh, uh, advertising in this time but the jobs are out there and it's a way to really navigate where to find them how to look for them also on our site we've built out our own career portal so we have hundreds of jobs open every single day and we have a staff who matches individuals with employers works with people one-on-one -on -one, live phone calls and zoom you name it we're there to support people to find what is out there and, and how to get those jobs so you saw the two uh two times there uh that are gonna be offered today look we've peter we've heard reports from business owners saying many of their employees don't want to come back to work because they're making more on unemployment due to that extra six hundred dollar federal covid compensation but that's expected <laughs> to end at the end of july so what's right. your message to the people not returning to work, but are being offered their old job back. Yeah, the, the, the recovery dollars, the, the support dollars there are temporary, and I think we all have to look at it that way. And those who may be making a little bit more right now, we don't want to think short term. We have to be able to get back to what is in demand. If the employers are hiring and it's safe to go back, then really consider what that's going to mean because the the support dollars again will go away soon and they're only intended to prop things up right. during this very difficult time but think beyond now and if the environment is safe and the job is there and you can do it uh, we do encourage people to go back but safety first all right that's uh, appreciate your time here peter some great advice here and some great resources for people out there that are looking for a job you're helping out a lot of people really appreciate that peter mm -hmm. but you bet all right have a great day Thank you, too.